Chinese people tend to be very apprehensive about death. The Enable Project, supported by the Hong Kong Jockey Club, aims to promote a positive understanding of life and death in society, so that when one is faced with the departure of a loved one, there will be less regret and more cherishing. Leslie Locke, a funeral director, is explaining to a group of university students how to prepare for a memorial service. She hopes this will enable the younger generation to discuss the topic of death with an open mind. If everyone can be very open to talk about this problem, the wedding is very easily done, and also can be healed by the old people's heart. The young people can also be healed by the old people's heart, and can be healed by the old people's heart. Recognizing the importance of handling pain, the Hong Kong Jockey Club is supporting the Enable Project in order to dispel taboos and encourage people to face death bravely. This plan is to help the dying patient have a happy ending, to help the elderly have a happy ending, to help the young people have a happy ending, to help the elderly have a happy ending, to help the young people have a happy ending, to help the elderly have a happy ending, to help the young people have a happy ending, to help the elderly have a happy ending. 係好開心、好美善咁樣咧，係每一日活每一日嘅。Starting from this year, the club is supporting the University of Hong Kong Center on Behavioral Health in running the Enable Project. Over the past 12 years, the center has been involved with work in various related areas. Jennifer has been a participant in the center's bereavement group. Although her father passed away 21 years ago, she still hasn't got over the pain. After attending the course, not only could she release herself from the agony, she has also learned to cherish the days with her mother all the more. I lost my mother. She's 90 years old. I will leave her in the future. When she has memories, I let her know that I and my brother and my sister are very sad. I can say that we don't have any help. With the club's funding, the center is able to train professionals more systematically to give assistance to those in need and help the public understand better how to face death. The dying to live peacefully, the living to bid farewell with no regrets. Let's hope that we can face the various stages of life, birth, aging, illness, and dying with an outlook that's positive and bright.